Hello viewers, Eid Mubarak, and welcome to your favorite program, The Vintage Heritage Show. My name is Jim Briggs. On today's program, we'll be showcasing the sight and sound of Salah celebration that took place in the Asian city of Kano State. Stay tuned, we'll be right back. Eid al Adha, also referred to as the Festival of Sacrifice, is celebrated worldwide by Muslims and is marked with the slaughtering of rams, cows, camels, goats, and sheep, depending on the individual's financial strength. <laughs> The Vintage Heritage Show visited the Haram Makaranta Livestock Market in Kano State, where rams, cows, and other animals are sold for the festival. At the market, livestock sellers decried the high cost of rams and cows in the market. The cattle sellers at the livestock market in Kano attributed the increase in prices to transportation due to high cost of diesel. I'm Anwar Mahmoud Darma. I do my business here in uh, 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 Makaranta, opposite zone here in Sharada. Actually, the issue here that we are facing in this uh, market here is it will not uh, pass uh, government influence about the issue of transportation, diesel, and some other things that make the price to rise. As a result of that, uh, the difference of market is uh, we bought some uh, product from maybe we do and from other places very close to us. When you go to some other power places, the diesel. Uh, that uh, the cars that used to carry the product from uh, the market to uh, our places we find it very difficult to pay them for example uh, when you said you buy goods from the you may be very, very less price for them to deploy them to your marketplace meanwhile if you go somewhere else like purchase come the price will change so uh, you see the price of diesel the duly employs the high price of these for, uh, uh, for animals that we used to sell Actually, the animals, look at them, they are very good enough for this set of uh, celebration and everything and they are ready for that. But the price actually is very high as a result of these things that I've already told you that influences uh, uh, the, the business, yes. Uh, actually, the patronage from the people is actually most, mostly businessmen are the persons that used to buy these products, these animals here with us. 
because people have been complaining that government have never paid salary yet for them to be able to do that. Somebody that maybe uh, previously might be able to slaughter one uh, uh, cow, now we have to uh, go and call his friend or one of his persons to come and do it to, uh, to, to cause slaughter, uh, only one for them. But previously he could be able to slaughter one himself, but now he cannot be able to do that as a result of the rise of the uh, price. Yes, so at least at least they were try, uh, people are trying this day actually as a result the price, even though this uh, problem that I have already said it before influences the business, the price we are trying to regulate and make sure that our market is part of the best among all these uh, cow selling market products. Yes. Ya man ataita fazita hubana asaitana wa jama'ta shamlana anta hadiyatu min Allah lana ba'da intidari ma lanka qul asana fi Let's enjoy this happy day Eid al-Mubarak Come on, let's celebrate Eid al Eid al-Adha festival is a religious rite in memory of the sacrifice performed by Prophet Abraham as an act of obedience to Allah's command. In commemoration of the festival, the animals slaughtered is divided into three parts as one shared is given to the poor and needy, another is kept for home, and the third portion is given to relatives. the Salah celebration in Kano, families took time out to relax and catch fun as they visited recreational centers and the Kano Zoological Garden to unwind.
Dover Festival, referred to as Hawan Daushi, is usually celebrated the second day of Eid festival in Kano. The celebration is filled with the traditional musical instrument and a spectacular traditional display of Africa's rich cultural heritage. Awandoshi, as it is locally called, is a royal parade of thousands of men on horses adorned with garments and beautiful regalia. It is a colorful display of culture full of poems and pageantry. The Doha Festival is a colorful ceremony which features many interesting activities 
and parade of the Emir and his entourage on horses. The Emir is often accompanied by musicians to the public square in front of the Emir's palace.
on the Vintage Heritage Show and I do hope you enjoyed every bit of the segment of the Salah Celebration. And with this we have come to the end of the segment and this program on the Vintage Heritage Show. On behalf of the entire production crew, I want to say thank you for joining us on the Vintage Heritage Show. We do want you to have a beautiful time, a beautiful day. Enjoy every moment of your life. Even as the Salah is still going on, be careful, stay out of drugs. And you just have to be good. Thank you for being with us. Till we come your way again on the Vintage Heritage Show. Bye-bye for now.